The year 2016 has almost come to a close. Time flies so fast that it has already been 10 years since we opened our first branch in Cagayan de Oro, along Dalmar Street in Cobos. On 1987, a new administration just took over. The Philippines was in economic crisis, but a few brave souls dared to invest, despite the financial and political turmoil of time. Thus, Davao Rosber Poncha was born out of the partnership of Mr. and Mrs. Chua and Mr. and Mrs. Ignacio, both families from General Santos City. From its humble beginnings with its first branch, located in Legaspi Street, Davao City, to 17 branches within Davao City and its neighboring municipalities in 2006. It was a challenging time because, since you're new, we still have to educate people of our services. And there are already a lot of pawn shops around. I have always wanted for our company to be the number one pawn shop in the areas that we serve as what have been inculcated to us in our company vision. We work hard and persevered to reach that goal. Now, we are already a dominant player in the area, and that's because of all your dedication and hard work. In keeping with this, Rosber made a name for itself in Davao as the pawn shop of the masses or Tita Rose, as Davao venues would fondly call us. Our auctions were a sight to behold as people from all walks of life queued to buy our items because of their quality, the super low prices that they were offered from the latest gadgets to the finest jewelries. You name it, we have it! This coupled with our excellent customer service was what set us apart from the competition. Devo Rosberg's success can be attributed to the following building relations with its clients, transparency of the services, and innovation in the pawn shop industry. 2006 was a milestone for the Rosfer as it was the year that Mr. Vincent Eric L. Chua officially took over as operations manager together with his brother Mr. Jonathan Edward L. Chua as vice president for finance. The tandem proved to be a success as both were young, eager, innovative, open for change. They had foresight as to where they want the company to be in the future. This paved the way for Rosverse expansion outside Davao City. 2006 was also the year when our operations manager, Mr. Vincent Chua, set his sight to northern Mindanao. The first branch, Kogondo Mar, was opened on April 2006, followed by four more branches in Corales, Carmen, Kogon in Cagayan de Oro, and in Malaybalay on 2008 under the leadership of then-area head, Mr. Richard Dionio. 2009 marked a new phase as Rosver changed its name to New Pag-asa Pawn Shop in Northern Mindanao and relaunched itself with a new trade name. This was easily adopted by the locals and click as the name was easy to remember and complemented our services. November 2010, Mr. Alexander Luntao was appointed as Business Development Officer for Northern Mindanao. Management believes in giving equal opportunity to all its employees. Everyone is given a fair chance to grow within the company, provided that they are willing to be trained and work hard for it. It is management's aim to mold and train all its employees to become future leaders. Our motto is to hire for attitude and train for skills. There's a lot of room for everyone to grow within the company. And rest assured that with New Pagasa Pojap, you can never go wrong. From 2011 to 2015, another seven branches were added in different locations from Iligan, Cagayan, and Caragar region. 
I, this year marks my 10th year with the company. And through the challenges and triumphs, the company is always with me. During my first few years, I was contemplating on moving, but the longer I stayed, the more I have grown to love my work. And for the coming years, I am looking forward to future expansions and other areas and opportunities for growth within the organization. If you are willing to work hard and have the right attitude, it won't be long till your potential will be recognized and doors will open. I know this from experience and looking back, I could say that I made the right choice. I'm looking forward to the challenges that lie ahead in line with our expansion which will open opportunities not only for myself but everyone in the company as well. Ako nagpasalamat sa pagsanig sa kumpanya sa mga dagkong butan nga gipiyal na ko sulod sa kumpanya. Naon pa nga sunod pa mga katuigan panayin nga po ng ilang ang inyong pagsaling na ko. Today, Pag-asa Pawnshop Northern Mindanao is 13 branches, strong and counting, from a staff of 40 to 120. There is still a lot of room for growth in the area, and rest assured that the management will always be there to support you along the way. Management also wants to take this opportunity to thank and acknowledge everyone here in Northern Mindanao. From the branch managers, operations in charge, management trainee, sales coordinator and sales associates, vault in charge, tellers, runners, guards, we salute you, for without you, none of this would be possible. This is our 10 year in the area, 10 years of giving our clients the best service there is, 10 years of giving joy to our customers. Thank you, Northern Mindanao. Let us all stand proud and continue to strive for excellence. I hope you will continue to struggle to do your best so that we will be able to maintain our dominance here in Cagayan de Oro. For that, I would like to extend my utmost gratitude and appreciation to all your contribution to the success of Pag-asa Pawn Shop in the past years, especially to our BDO, Mr. Alex Luntao, who has been very effective in leading your group towards our common goal. And of course, to our very active and enthusiastic area manager, Dino Lingat. It's very unfortunate that we will not be able to celebrate this night with all of you, but still, I wish you and your family happy holidays and a prosperous new year.